Yo, what's going on everyone? This is Smitty here and I'm expanding a bit off of what Resolve had did with his video talking about the QB dropbacks and Madden and how you're able to just throw off the back foot, throw the ball downfield with no problems, which we all know this is a problem in Madden. We know that's been going on for the longest, even back on PS2 days, we know that. Um, now, I'm taking a slightly different approach. I'm not doing it exactly how he did. I'm just taking it a step further. Because um, what he did was, you know, he basically just scrambled from snap, just ran backwards, and then just threw it up. And you've seen how he completed passes, which, like I said, we all have seen content across YouTube, Twitch, wherever avenue where that happens. And that's been a problem that's plagued Madden. Even, even your favorite Madden, you can do that kind of stuff in. So it's been a problem for the longest amount of time. Okay? Now... When now what I'm doing here, the way I'm going to showcase it, I'm going to showcase APF as well because I had said on the show on a Sim Standard Radio, I said on the show the other day that I can do the same thing in APF and replicate that so that kind of success with just dropping back to pass and just jamming on the stick and trying to throw it forward at the last second, and I get and I can get legitimate success with it. So you're going to see those examples in momentarily here, but I'm showcasing this because primarily as a community, I mean, I've, I'm, I've done it. Many people have done it. Sim, Azura done it, Moody, all, the, all of the more known people in this community and everybody far and wide. We have all basically primarily pointed out Madden in terms of where the game falls short, where the game drops the ball at where the game needs to be where it's flawed etc and then what we would primarily do is showcase 2k in terms of how it's supreme and how it does everything right like we just showcase primarily positive examples not many negatives at all you know so we, you know you really don't have anybody saying outside of the fact that the game is old saying hey you know what it's a good game but it does have these shortcomings it does have these flaws or whatever like we don't really do any of that but what I'm doing is I'm taking the approach of that 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 I basically we use here in Madden and just comparing it that's why I'm titling the video game recognized game because the game's basically doing the talking here so as you guys see from what I what I mainly was trying to do here uh, QB like the first segment well, against the Packers you've seen what I did I just did the straight up just regular drop back and then I would just press the stick forward pass, try and pass it at the last second before I would get sacked or get hit now I'm getting hit a lot here because of the blitz you know like I got five down linemen they're coming with like six or seven guys so I'm going to have problems getting that pass out there but you see what's going on here. I'm able to get the ball regardless in the general vicinity, even with the pressure in my face, even if I run into, you know, to the sideline or whatever, in which we all know this is a problem and we would love it to be tough, tougher. We would love to see, you know, uh, a quarterback get more penalized, like a, a stiffer penalty for dropping back far like that and then just turning up, turning around on a, on a whim and just able to just chuck it upfield and potentially uh, have a successful reception okay now starting it off here with APF now and as you guys see now I'm starting off in replay here because I love this pass animation and this is the difference here is the animation that they make you do for the most part like I drop back I'm doing a regular drop back to pass about like 10 15 yards and then you see the animation they make me do so I press the stick forward, hit the receiver button, and then they make me do that drawn out animation, but I love how it played out here in terms of uh, Moss looking the ball in, making the reception, going in for the score there. You know what I'm saying? Like, these are the things that we love about APF. We love seeing these things. You know, and that's why I love this game. Like I just bought I just had to rebuy this game about a month ago because my disc was scratched up. So I had to get another one. And uh but as you guys see here, 
I'm able to replicate the success just jamming on the stick and I'm able to throw forward but what I do like is that the, the further I drop back there's an animation that plays out that takes a lot longer you know what I'm saying like uh, I have to get my feet set or it's gonna make me to take the extra steps back so it's like a you know cost benefit kind of deal so you got to be mindful of the space you got when it comes to trying to get that pass out there and I love that part of this game like I love that what when 2k did in that regard um, some people don't like it because you lose control and that's what I pointed out on the show as well is that yes you do lose control but at the same time it does make sense it's a sensible trade-off to me um, but as you saw there as you guys are seeing look at what I'm basically for the majority able to do defender in my face or not whether I I drop I drop back 15 I mean you see how many yards I'm basically dropping back and I'm able to throw strikes and hit the receiver in stride so you see what I'm doing here in this clip I'm just doing a straight up drop back and then trying to throw well trying to throw it upfield here I keep getting popped because I did a similar similar scenario here I came with the blitz you know and I wanted to make sure I just had um, basically five down linemen and you see I'm, I drop back far and then I'm able to hit my receivers in stride no problem see what I mean so uh, and I'm doing and I'm, I'm using the controls the exact same way and throwing it off the back foot and everything now am I are you always am I always gonna complete the pass no not necessarily it doesn't mean you're gonna complete the pass at all times but you see what's going on here in principle I like I, if I drop back to pass jam the stick forward if I'm able to get the pass off I'm getting I'm getting like a legit a legitimate uh, lead here and I'm getting catches or they're gonna be basic drops so in this last part here this last segment of it what I did was uh, now I'm taking the Madden approach like well like what uh, Resolve Ad did I just scrambled back from snap and then just turn and gun and look what's going on like I'm throwing strikes see what I'm saying so both games have the same kind of issue and I mean look we know this game is eight years old nearly eight years old we get that if this is not this is not to break it down in a negative way and say oh don't play APF because of this like no it's got nothing to do with that well all, all I'm saying is if I if I uphold the game as a standard of excellence which is 2k which we all say that is the best by far I still say it's the best by far then I can use it in a both in a positive as well as a negative way even if it is even if this is showing it in a negative light still you know what I'm saying now how many now this is the thing in regards to the sim community how many of us play the game this way that's the key thing we got to bear in mind here how many of us are dropping back 25 30 yards and then throwing it upfield for 35 40 yards you see what I'm saying that's not how that's not how I play that's not how many of us play we don't play the game that way but as you guys see I can get that same success here just like it was demonstrated in Madden and I mean as we've seen over the years we've seen it many times over so yes it is definitely a problem but one thing though I'm going to close out here this video with this point the devs know they're behind the devs know they got to get the game there they said it at E3 they said it in the interviews that was done by Sim that was done by Moody you know what I'm saying and I'm gonna link those videos in the description you know um because at the end of the day they know they got to get the game there they know that is the game is not where it needs to be they're not saying that oh we got everything in everything's done the game's complete it's set no no one is they're not saying that and they, they're the ones they're the ones making the game and they're not saying it you see what I mean but I'm just showing this replay here because I love once again I love the animations here I love that that you know throw off the back foot even though he wasn't looking at the receiver per se I still love that stuff the way it plays out in a uh, APF here but 
I'm gonna link all those vids in the description. I'm gonna link the 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 interviews from Moody from Sim. I'm gonna link Resolve's video in there as well, cause I want people to see that. You know, I I want you to understand that these guys know that the game is not there and know that they got some work to do to get the game there. So just showcasing this replay here once again. Defense was right in his face, threw that thing on a rope, and barely got broke up there. So, like I said, it happens in both games, but once again, we know that APF is most definitely, you know, the better game in certain aspects. Not as many now, but certain aspects, okay? So, just wanted to, like I said, just wanted to make some key points here. And, I mean, I could link, I'll even link Sims video. He did a video showcasing flat-footed zone defense in APF you know what I'm saying and I've been on record saying before that 2k5 has the best zone play that I've experienced out of any football game because there is no flat-footed zone play in that game like they are constantly moving no matter what zone it is they're assigned to if nobody is in the flat or whatever they move more towards the center of the field or if a receiver is on a street they'll you know they'll they'll play soft they'll put a soft cushion between them and the safety so you know they like I love that play in that game that kind of play so yeah I definitely need that kind of stuff needed to be in Madden long ago, but as we as we should know that 2K had the same core lead development years ago, so development consistency is key. So with this Madden team, as long as they keep the team this core team together and keep working at it, they'll get the game there in due time. So we'll see. But uh, that's my time. Now I'll highlight y'all later. Peace.